Okay, Craig, so fresh from this morning announcing a new extension to your contract here at Kingston Park. How pleased are you to get that under your belt? Yeah, really pleased. It's obviously something that you want to have sorted out sooner rather than later. So, yeah, really pleased about that and getting a good opportunity for another two years to come on and as a club and both as a player to kick on and get more game time. Uh, so, yeah, it's good. You first stepped up back in September in the, in the Kings of the North tournament, sort of showing everybody glimpses of what you had and then... As things have turned out, you've had an opportunity to, to put a stamp on the big stage on the Aviva Premiership. What's that been like as an experience for you? Yeah, well, coming into this season, sort of, uh, a bit of game time in the Kings of the North stuff, and then, uh, yeah, ended up getting through injuries, a couple of opportunities in the Premiership, and, yeah, sort of found a bit of confidence from that and pushed on as a player, I think. So it was good to, to get these opportunities that I've had this year, and I feel like there's more to give. It's been obviously a lot different to what I've been used to in the past two years coming up from school into the sort of uh, senior academy playing for Tyndale and Bladen and then this year I've sort of got my got my chance and I've tried to take it so and the performances obviously in those games were eye-catching for fans coaches alike sort of what was the sort of feedback you've been getting from those performances um well obviously through the coaches I was pretty new to it all and coming in I felt like there's not really much to lose for myself personally so um, coaches are pretty positive feedback there's obviously a lot of stuff still to work on and I know that I can kick on with my uh, with the experience I've had and the experience I'll hopefully get towards the end of this season and next season and the next season after that so yeah it was all pretty positive and <clears throat> I think as a as a young player coming in at 10 in the, those first few premiership matches I played I felt like there wasn't a lot to lose and there wasn't a lot of pressure on me pers personally so um, I think it's just learning from that and Keeping going with that, really. And for a young fly half, how important is that that learning uh, process? You've got Dave Waller on the coaching team, who's obviously a, a very good 10 for the club over many years. There's Mike Delaney, and obviously in the short term, you've also had Andy Good to learn from. Yeah, well, there's a lot of a lot of experience around here at, at Falcon, so I've learned a lot and tapped into a lot from from what I've been told of them, and it's good to have people like Mike and, and Goody here because they're easily approachable and you can get a lot from from their previous experiences as well so I think that's all helped and, and especially with Dave as well he's uh, he's pretty good at simplifying what he wants and it's quite easy as a 10 to, to play to our structure and, and our shapes as well so and short term yeah. targets? Uh, short term obviously this season try and get we'll get us safe and get a bit more game time to, well, towards the end of the season and push on from where I've been and get back to where I was a few weeks back so um, that's the short term sort of target and then yeah press on for towards the end of this season and put my face back in the frame for next season coming into pre-season so